Praise the name of the Lord. Shalom family. Once again, you're welcome. Welcome to this amazing, great, awesome word, awesome session. It's your friend, it's your sister, Dr. Irene, and I bring you a very timely word from the Lord. It's always a privilege for me to bring you words from the Lord. Like I say on a daily basis, God will give a word to his people. God bless you. As you like this video, you subscribe to this ministry, become part of what God is doing, and the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I hear you saying these words. I heard you saying this word. This is no more a joke. You said this so clearly. You said this is no more a joke. You know, you have gotten to a level where you can no more accept it. To the level where you can no longer tolerate it. And I heard you said this. This is no longer a joke. I need to do something. And the Lord says, I should give you this word. says, truly it's no longer a joke what is going on is no longer a joke and you need to know that you know the lord was teaching me something this evening he says no matter what you do no matter the height you go people always talk people will always say something whether what you're doing is right or what you're doing is wrong or what you're doing is how they will always say something so when god has given you an assignment god has given you a purpose something to do and you're hearing people talking because i hear people talking and talking and talking and they have gotten to a certain level and you are like ah this is this has gone beyond this is no longer a joke this has gone beyond people just talking probably there is something behind what they are saying probably i'm not really called probably i'm not really gifted to do all of these things the lord says i should give you this word he says they will always talk you know the bible says in the book of matthew chapter 7 verse 3 to verse 5 specifically when we read verse number 5 it says first take it says let me take the speck out of your eyes why the lock is in your own eye you hypocrites so this is how jesus described them they pretend as if they want to remove a speck in the eyes of their neighbors whereas there is a block of wood in their own eyes they are complaining about what you're doing complaining about mistakes complaining about all of that whereas if you go detail into what they are doing they have got worse things and god says focus on your journey focus on your assignment focus on where he has sent you and don't doubt one bit that what he has asked you to do because it will surely come to pass in the name of jesus amen god bless you shalom